Today we're showing you the top 10 scams inside of Adopt Me so you know what to avoid. The first scam involves two players going and having a conversation with each other but secretly they're owned by the same person. What will happen is one of them will say that they're trading a very rare pet such as a frost dragon or a bat dragon and they're going and looking for something specific for it. I've seen an example where they say they're trading a mega neon frost dragon for an ana rattle. Then the other person who is partaking in this scam will be trading an ana rattle. Because not many people have this item, people are then going to overpay so much to get this ana rattle because they think they can then go and trade it for a frost dragon. This is such a sneaky technique and is used a lot of the time in scamming in Adopt Me and actually in real life. Remember to be careful and watch this whole video to protect yourself from all of these Adopt Me scams. Scam number two, someone is going to tell you that if you go and purchase their lemonade or their hot dogs or anything that is available with Adopt Me Cash, they will go and in return give you a free pet. This however, the majority of the time will actually be a scam. Some people might say they have trade proofs or just that it's real, however it's not. What I could do right now is go and get an alt account on and walk up to this lemonade stand. On the alt device, I would go and type out saying that OMG, I just got my dream pet by spending a thousand bucks. By then showing an example that someone has just got a dream pet from it, everyone else in the server is then going to be more tempted to go and do it as they think it might be a genuine deal. However, what's actually happening is that they are just going and getting scammed and using both alt accounts, resulting in you losing thousands of Adopt Me bucks. Up next is actually an extremely common scam on TikTok or social media, which you definitely need to be wary of. So the most common thing that I see is people fake claiming that they are quitting Adopt Me, whereas they're not, they're going and tricking you to think that they are quitting the game. What happens is that you now think they're going to quit the game and you're going to go and get a bunch of free pets because, you know, they're quitting, so they're obviously going to get rid of their pets for free. This is not true and what it actually is is a fake video and what they're going to do is go and hack your Roblox account. How this works is that they will say oh I'm quitting and then they'll send you a link. This link will take you not onto the actual Roblox platform but onto a fake Roblox login. What you will then do is type your login details and then they will be going and stealing your login password and your username. They'll then log into your real Adopt Me account and take your pets. So what you think you're doing is getting some free pets from this person, whereas what's actually going to happen is you're going to get hacked and lose all of the pets on your account. So if someone ever says they're quitting Adopt Me and giving away their pets, 99% of the time it's a scam. And if you ever receive a link to log onto Roblox from any website, do not ever do it. This next scam is actually someone who genuinely got scammed and is a fan of mine and what it says is, hello, I'm a professional GFX artist. Do you want free GFX? Basically what GFX is, is something that can go and turn your Roblox avatar into a cool looking photograph. And this person is supposedly offering a free service. And to go and do that, you have to go and send them some files. The thing that they do, they'll then send you a tutorial on how to send these files over. And what this file does is contains every single password saved on your computer. So by sending them that file, obviously they then have all the passwords that they need to know on how to log onto your Roblox account. They'll then log on and take all of your Adopt Me pets while you're still waiting for them to send you a lovely piece of fan art or GFX. So what you think is going to be a great image of your Roblox character is actually a scam. I've had thousands of people message me this obviously. So stay away completely. If you do want to get a free GFX, there is at no point do they need any file. They can access it them all themselves by literally typing your username, so you would never have to send anyone any type of file. The file name is .har, so if anyone even mentions that file, make a runner and block them. The next scam that I've gone and seen is people joining into a server and saying they can duplicate your pets. Surprisingly, they will actually go and duplicate your pet. I went and experienced this the other day. I went and traded someone a cat. And what they're doing is not actually using anything to duplicate it. They're just going and giving you their cat 
cats back. So you give them one cat and you get two cats back. The reason why is because they're trying to go and gain your trust. Once you now realize that you think that you can go and actually physically duplicate your pets, you'll obviously want to go and do it again, but give them something better. So first of all, you give them a cat to see if they can actually go and do it. And if that worked and they give you two cats back, they now have your trust and you're then going to go and give them something good. So because I now believed them that they would duplicate my pet, I'd be more tempted to give them a rare pet such as a legendary in hope that they will go and duplicate my legendary. Whereas what they'll actually do is just go and take that legendary and leave the server as they have just gone and scammed you. So basically they're duplicating your first pet by just going and giving away a pet and then afterwards they will go and scam you and leave the server. So if you ever see someone in the game quoting that they can go and duplicate your pets, do not trust it, it's 100% a scam. There is physically no possible way to go and duplicate a pet inside of Adopt Me, it's not possible and there are things to go and prevent that from happening. And if you were able to go and duplicate pets, you would go and be banned from the game. The next scam that I'll go and see is people say that they are trading something such as a frost dragon or a shadow dragon or an owl and they'll say that they're trading it for something which is actually really common. So what they do is they say, I'm trading my owl for a, a dog. And obviously no one in their right mind is going to go and trade an owl for a dog. It's going to sound suspicious and a scam. However, lots of children are obviously excited that, oh, I can get an owl and I only have to trade them my dog. Then again, what they'll do is send you a link on social media, which is actually a scam link where they'll then go and steal your password. Again, watch out on social media as this is the most common way that people are getting targeted. If you have social media and follow Adopt Me, be sure to go and make sure you are safe online. A good way to help prevent you from being scammed is by going and enabling two-factor authentication. Everyone, make sure you have this enabled and it will prevent you from being hacked. That means if someone tries to log into your account, you will then have to go and type a pin in or get an email to go and make sure that you didn't actually go and log in, which will prevent you from losing your pets. This isn't 100%, but will definitely help. If you do ever get hacked, you can always go and click on the report button. By clicking on that, you can then go and say what happened and how you managed to get scammed and fill out your report on the Roblox Adopt Me website where you'll then have a chance of going and getting your pets back with a one-off chance. The next scam, probably the most common one, is called trust trading where you go and give them a pet in the hopes that they'll give you a pet back. Obviously, there is absolutely no point to doing this. A trust trade is literally identified as a scam. There is no purpose to doing it, it gives you no benefit, nor is it fun. So never do a trust trade inside of Adopt Me. Again, it's completely pointless. And if you're still not sure what a trust trade is, it's basically this. I trade someone and say, I will give you your pet back if you go and do this and then they trade them and you give them their pet and then they'll just leave the server and have successfully claimed a free pet. It's literally so common, I don't understand how people still fall for trust trades. Do not go and do it, it's literally a scam. There is no need to ever do a trust trade inside of Adopt Me. It's not good, just don't do them guys or you'll 100% be scammed all of the time. It's just pointless. And lots of the time people say, oh, do a trust trade and then I'll give you a free pet. It's just don't do it. Um, hang on, how am I um, swimming here? This does not seem okay. How, how is this? What? You guys seeing this? I think I broke a me. Um, okay. The next thing I've seen is a bunch of people saying that they're a TikToker and they're filming a video where I go and give dream pets back if you give me the legendary first. Um, I'm not sure about this one because the fact that there, there is a very slim chance that that could be real because obviously I make videos sometimes where someone will give me a pet and then I'll give them like a ride potion or a fly potion. Like the other day I did one where I went and gave away a free fly potion for nothing. Like if I saw someone else saying that, I'd probably think it was a scam. So the majority of the time, like 99% of the time, 
it's probably a scam unless they have a golden name. And if they do have a golden name and they scam you, then they're not gonna have a golden name for long. So they'll say that, oh, I'm doing a TikTok and I'm recording. And yeah, it's just not going to be true. It's going to be a scam. You're not going to go and get your dream pet from doing this. So definitely keep an eye out for this and be careful. That's it for the top 10 scams that you need to avoid inside of Adopt Me. I hope you did find this video useful and helped you go and prevent you from being hacked and getting scammed in the future. Send this video to your friends so they also know what to do on not to get scammed or hacked. If it's your birthday, happy birthday, use Starco's candy when purchasing Robux. Bye-bye.